What's up everybody, Money here, and we are back playing some No Man's Sky. We got some whoa. We got some weird little mohawky uh giraffe zebra things there. Uh but we have some missions to do today. We are continuing on with what used to be the Artemis missions, which now has turned into Ghosts in the Machine. That's right, uh, we got a frequency from Artemis when we got cut off for somebody named Apollo, and we needed to locate and activate a hollow terminus, which brings us... Mm, there! Ta-da! Hollow terminus. Uh, yeah, so let's see what's going on. Hopefully they got like an elevator here or something. Oh, nope, nope. Just stairs. Fantastic. Well, we just had a long flight, so I guess it's okay. Speaking of long flights, I was just playing a little bit of a Flight Sim World. Still wondering if I might record a little bit of that eventually, once I learn a little bit of it. And uh, that'd be fun. But yeah, whoa. Just flying made me think of it. I'm playing all kinds of different things. What? What's the other game I just picked up? Uh, Ultimate General Gettysburg? No. The Civil War one. The full-out Civil War one. Played the... Finished off the Gettysburg one, both Union and uh, Civil. But hey, whatever. No Man's Sky. Here we go. Uh, Hollow Terminus. Just chatting as we went up the stairs. You know, you know. Okay, Hollow Terminus activated. Multiple signs. Sources available. We just want to talk to Apollo, but... Tower hosts a powerful transmitter designed to facilitate. Uh, yeah, we know what it does. Tune into Apollo. Whoa, hey. <laughs> Didn't realize it just like shot that thing up there. Wait, is this nice? Something else completely new. Look at this dude. Spoilers of Apollo. Hold on. Spoilers, but I'm still taking a picture of it. Yo, buddy. Hold on, let's change the change the settings of maybe... Oh, can we move the sun? Ooh, I like it. Take a, take a shot there, uh, hide menu. And uh, let's see, how about... Uh, hold on, hold on, one more, one more. For the camera, please. Uh, change settings, change time of day. Uh, we are going to... Let's go to nighttime. Oh, I should mess with the lens, too, a little bit. Make this guy kind of a trippy hello. How about that? Oh, a little nighttime shot. And the lens... No, not the lens. Let's go with... It's all pretty weird with that stuff in the background. Let's see if we can make it weirder. Um... Scene. Filter. Ooh. Uh, stock. Stock looks pretty good. Artistic. Looks crazy. Green. Contrast. I like the contrast. For, like, the, uh, the spoiler screenshot. Alright, uh, okay. No, 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 no. Whoa. Uh, change, move the sun. Hold on. Change time of day. And here we go, learning about photography on No Man's Sky. No, we want to we wanna figure out what he has to say. And you guys are like, what's he got to say? So let's, um, hide menu. Screenshot the old-fashioned way. And, uh, interact. What'd you do with Artemis, Apollo? The stranger stares at me. Uh, hey, you look like something out of, um... Assassin's Creed, like the, the future world alien-y things. Okay, uh, stare back. I was just thinking about getting back into my Assassin's Creed 3, like, ten minutes ago. Uh, greet Apollo. Oh, I should stare back. Staring contest. Identify yourself, or I will end this call. Uh, yeah, oh, I'm, uh... Let's name drop. I'm a friend of Artemis. No, you're not. Uh, ask why. Why do you use that word at all? Friend is just a label, a pretense, to make you feel better. Uh, yeah, I thought friend was a stretch. 
Just trying to ease it out. Nice little shoulder pads, by the way. Uh, why are you contacting me anyway? Is Artemis behind this? I haven't changed my mind. I don't care if some dream says we're travelers. I'll meet if I'm paid to meet. Haha, <laughs> he's all about the money. Even this conversation is a waste of valuable contract time. Say Artemis is in trouble. That fool again? Come on, man, let's get the gang back together. Uh, I'll tell Apollo that Artemis is in trouble. That they attempted to use a portal and become stranded on some distant and uncharted world. Disappearing from the Hollow Terminus network? Apollo's demeanor changes. They appear uncomfortable at the news. Yeah, you better. Send me your data logs. Let me see for myself. I should be like, no, dude. You rude. I'll upload it. Here's the USB stick. Put it in your... Apollo studies the log, pausing and replaying the various segments of static and distortions. They turn to me with a glow of excitement. Wait. Don't get all excited. These noises, these sounds, just like the echoes of sentinel events. You've seen them before, of course. Drawing, drawings. <laughs> Drones that appear from nowhere if you interfere with the precious planets. No, oh, they just are there everywhere. <clears throat> The Viking will pay handsomely if we figure out how the Sentinels appear so quickly. Uh, I would pay for a little bit for that too. Uh, and this recording of yours, the portals, perhaps they are the key. Um, suggest life is worth more than money. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the money side. That's kind of what we're about. We're gonna go all. Uh, I'll let Han Solo on you. Oh, uh, so what do you say? Do you want to work together on this? Be partners? Okay, here we go. Apollo and Monty. If you're going to work with me, your equipment needs to be in good condition. We can't have you dying out there. Not yet, at least. Yeah, give me laser upgrades. You can find nanite clusters scattered in abandoned buildings. Yep. Trade these nanite clusters with merchants. Okay, I know that. Tell me something I don't know. As the hologram recedes, Apollo heads head his head turns to the side ever so slightly, as if sighing, saddened. Or perhaps it was nothing, a ghost in the machine. Ha ha ha. That's the title of the get it? Ghost in the machine. Let's see if that thing gets sucked right back. Yeah, it does. Shpew. All right, uh, okay, locate a Viking multi-tool trader. Return to space and locate a Viking trader. Well, that's uh, that's pretty easy enough, easy enough. We are not in a Viking system here. We are actually in a system of Gek. Ge Whoa, okay, hey, yep. So we're going to uh, get back to our ship. And get on up out of here. But hope you guys are doing all well. Seems like Apollo's doing good. We've got a uh, partner in crime. And other than that, look at that. I agree. These Sentinels must die. We need to return to a mission agent. We also need to... Uh, deliver some iron. So we could do a little bit of that. Uh, where? Where could we do a little bit of that? Hmm. Let's see if it uh, gives us an option here. How much iron do we have? 221, which was the problem. So let's at least fly somewhere different. Maybe, maybe find an exosuit. What's this? It's like, that's a weird floating base. Right, drop it down. What we need to make sure we get is some iron. Can't say no to this, though. Oops. Oops. Whoa. Hello. I'm here for your iron. Uh, all oh, these old guys. Look at them. Alright, here we go. Uh, see what we got in the cargo pods? 
we will throw down a unknown sector save and chart. It has now been charted by Monty Foeva. Foeva. Moeva. All right, here we go. What do we got in here? Some grossness. A forsaken terminal. We got to get more goop. Haven't gotten goop for a while. Uh, user identified. Terminal now active. Unlocking data log for analysis. It looked like a wound in the world. Crimson and... Okay, okay, okay. We got a lot of these. I'm not going to read them all. Was it dead? Did he touch it? Someone... Oh, hey, what's going on? I should have left it alone. Yeah, you should have. Still going to analyze the data, though. I discovered something coded deep inside the long dead traveler's data log. Creepy. Something has been left that will aid me on my own journey. Nanite clusters. All right. That'll help me. So let's get on out of here. Ooh, Thamium. Can't get enough of this stuff because it's never around when I'm really, really looking for it. So I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. What else we got on here? I think the only goods here would be uh, the frosty uh, window stuff, which we don't need none of that. So, do I have enough? <clears throat> Iron. Yes. Deliver iron. Locate secure depot. Uh, uh Where's one going to be? Are you going to tell me? Come on. Shelter. Uh, mountain. Okay. That's actually really nice looking. Um, it's not telling me nothing. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hey, look, a base. Or, you know, something we could make a base. Oh, bases. It'd be nice if we were, like, leveled up a bunch. You get, like, multiple bases or larger bases. Something. Something. Bueller. All right. What's... Nope. Nothing. 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 Ouch. Here we go. Like nothing ever happened. We gotta fly around more often. Oh, this is a terrible blizzard. You're blowing me all over the place. Come on now, flip it around. What I was hoping to find oh, oh, was either exosuit stuff or. Oh, look at that. A beacon on the water. Beacon on the water. Alright, we're gonna get it. I'd really like to... Maybe there's some uh, kelp sacks or whatever we need in here. Hold on, let's go figure it out. Drop off this iron somewhere, but I'm not looking for the right places. Usually it automatically finds a waypoint. Not today, Sonny, not today. Advanced life form detected. Okay, cool. And not really what we need. All right, let's go for a jump and a swim. Ouch, not as deep as I thought it would be. Smacked right onto the bottom. Ooh, what's that? Nothing good. Well, this lake was a bummer trip, man. All right, let's get back to the ship, everybody. And I'm going to uh, go ahead and get up on out of here. You know what I'm going to do? I will bring you guys back. Uh, ouch. Once we, um... Hold on, let me get inside. It's a little nasty out. Once we... Do, 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 do. Uh, let's return to the farmer. And uh, finish off the agricultural research quests. And um, then we'll probably work on the Viking system uh, next episode. But let's go ahead and hit it back to base. So let's see if anything happens fun owns the Waysies. Which I doubt it because it's right there. So we're just going to hop on out. I'm going to throw down a little left bumper, right bumper. Oh, you know what? Whoa, not where I wanted to go. Not where I wanted to go. 
Let's slow it down a bit so I can line myself up here. We don't have money for freighters yet, so I'm not even in the market, buddy. Not where I wanted to go, again. It locked onto the habitable base. There we go. Now, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna put the controller down. With the new update, <clears throat> they uh, supposedly worked on the mouse and keyboard controls. So that's actually why <clears throat> I left and went back to the controller. One thing they added was you can press Alt and look around in the cockpit, but obviously not during uh, this kind of, not during this kind of stuff, once we're in normal flight mode. So I pre-apologize if things get a little crazy, but I've switched over to M and K, mouse and keyboard. And uh, we're gonna get this going here. I don't even remember what boot. No, no, not the time, not the time. So how, okay, not, that's tab. I don't know how I can bring up special things. Like uh, how I bring up like the little hot bar and quickly upgrade stuff. Nope, nope, nope. You gonna bring me down on it? Thank you. Thank you. All right. Ooh. Okay. All right. So this is the new like mouse control. You know what this feels like? <clears throat> Man, excuse me. I just needed some water. Uh, what this feels like is like. Uh, Mech Warrior Online, like when you're in a heavier mech, because it takes time to turn. I, I, I like, I like that feel, that drag. Ooh, I don't like that the weapons don't line up with that little icon. Let's zoom in and then Alt to look around. That's okay. It's okay. Where am I? There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, I don't. I don't like it. I don't like this. Hold on. Wrong buttons. Oh my. Hold on. Back. Then I'll know exactly what I'm doing. Oh my. Okay, here we go. Forward. Boost. Left bumper, right bumper. So much better. Look around easily with the right control stick move with the left control stick. Oh. Yes. Can't do it. I could probably, you know, get some, get used to it. But I, my, my fingers were all in the wrong places. Alright, we are back in radiated and grumpy. And dropping on down to the Colossus Bay. Space. Alright, here we go. Too high to initiate landing. So says nobody. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yep, yep, yep. Everyone's looking good. Where's my hover? Who took my hover? Who took my hover? Archer, you take my hover. Tim, take my hover. Someone took my hover. Uh. Okay, let's go talk to the farmer. Bring the hover back. Here we go. Mine. Some. Oh, that's the Colossus. Oh, there's the hover. Oh, was it in front of me the whole time? Never mind. Ooh. You can tell I haven't been back at base for a while. Got a lot growing here. Got a lot growing. But what's most important, down at the end, that was Star Bramble. We just finished those last time. Uh, but we have the uh, the Mordite growing, so let's make sure we got enough carbon in there. And uh, hopefully, do I have enough Mordite on me? No, so let's cheat the system and go grab some. What I'm going to do with all the uh, frost stuff here frost weed what is this frost wart turn all that into glass and then sell the glass because i was making some good money on that 
So what do we got on this storage container? Speaking of, we can drop some of that. Drop some of that. And look at that, a lot of cactus flesh, selenium, good stuff in that. Good stuff in that. But I do believe if I go down to the end, Ah, there we go. 250 should be more than sufficient for the farmer. And click on it. Ooh, this could be this is the final plant, everybody. We this is the final base mission if I if I do think so properly. Uh hand in 25 more night. Let me see it. Let me see it. Hey, by the way, I saw your twin in the station the other day. Uh, you have mastered so much of your botanical art, my friend. I am a botanical man. It is a pity you can digest so little of your own produce. Well, that's okay. The smell alone. I'm, I'm good, dude. Uh, the farmer has no more tasks for me. Uh, they tell me that their contract is at an end and that they will be returning to get to... Aw, oh, he's gonna go. As they discuss their leaving plans, they watch the ceiling carefully. It is unclear what they're looking at. Uh, oh, I can't even look myself. Hmm. But it can be true. I shared meals with the Overseer, and I'm fine. They would never do anything to harm any of us. The Overseer only wants what is best. Well, the Overseer is another geck, too. I. Hmm. A moment later, the farmer stops speaking. They assure me that they were just joking and beg me not to speak of this matter again. You know, you know, I'm not going to just thank him. Are you, are you okay? Do you need a chat? They claim that they are, their eyes glistening in the darkness of the base. Dude, I just lit up this area. He doesn't look very, doesn't look very dark. What are you looking at, dude? What's up there? Oh, what the heck? Get out of my base, buddy. Nobody let you in. Nobody invited you. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. Come on, man. At least put on, like, a good radio station and do something useful. Fly around. Giving, like, news updates or something. Okay. Um, hey. He's got something more to talk about. He's still here. What? What's up? Sorry. Were you saying something? I'm not feeling like myself, Traveler. I do not think I should go. Not yet. Yes, right. That's right. I will stay. Yeah, see, I had a feeling. Had a feeling. <coughs> smile at them. Ah, They have nowhere else to go. I'm going to smile and slowly walk away. Happy to be here among the plants. Call me a plant, buddy. Call me a plant. Uh, ghost in the machine. All right. Well, check it out. Uh, nothing else. Nothing else to do at the base. We have completed all the base missions. The farmer's done. The armor, done. The technician, done. The overseer, done. Yep, that's right. We finished them all out. Yep. Hello, Mr. Overseer. What do you got? Like a bonus for finishing everything? No. Yeah, you're guilty. You got a lot to talk about. Um, going to touch him gently? No, we're just gonna let him be. Because we've already touched him gently, and he was kind of awkward about that. Um, yeah. Which, to be honest, I would have been awkward about that, too. But, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, and, uh, robots, because, you know, or whatever, uh, we, we knocked it out. The base is complete, even with the weird floating flag and all. All missions of the base are complete, so I feel no guilt when I completely uh, drop the bombs, demolish it, and move. And if we have to redo the missions, uh, I'm not going to do them on camera or anything because we've already done all the base missions. So until they come out with something new on that, we have seen it. Uh, the, don't worry, the series isn't over. We're going to keep on keeping on. We still have the primary mission, Ghosts in the Machine. And that's probably where we're going to pick it up next episode. Uh, going to a Viking system and I might be looking for a new home and then we also have to recover Atlas seeds whatever that is basically we just need to continue down 
the Atlas Path. So I will see you on one of those occasions. Until then, you guys all stay classy. Keep on gaming. Monte Rico Gaming. And make sure to comment below on what other games you would like to see on the channel. And let's keep on keeping on. But can you believe it? We are almost at episode 50 of No Man's Sky. That's going to be a record for the channel for episodes. So we will see you all next time. Thanks for watching. Peace.